mind-blowing text-to-video guys this is very exciting it's been a while since I've uploaded a video about a text-to-video solution the latest video was about Luma Labs which is doing a pretty decent job but this solution seems way better I've also tested this and I'll show you towards the end of the video my first impression and the videos that I've generated it's seems to me like this is a game changer in terms of generating videos from prompts i think this could be very powerful for creating ads for creating um shorts whatever you want to do this seems to be the most powerful tool available let me show you a few examples so the tool is called clink ai the pricing is pretty straightforward you can also generate um, videos for free but it's only like eight or eight or three bucks per month so i just paid for it because it's so cheap um, and i also wanted to test the pro version which allows the use of the new model let me show you a few examples that they share in their website and then we will sh i'll show you what i've generated with my prompts started testing it out um, this is the first video check it out it's pretty amazing what is hunger这是什么鬼这样的广告会有影响值吗我要一个汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡汉堡
where a giant panda adorned with black frame glasses is reading a book in a cafe. The book rests on the table accompanied by a cup of coffee that's steamingly gently, uh, steaming gently. Beside the cozy setting is the cafe's window with a cinematic color grading applied to enhance the visual appeal. As you can see over here, here they give a few more examples of different videos that they generated with the prompts. A Pikachu is sitting on a chair drinking cafe and reading a newspaper. Okay, nothing crazy. Many more prompts, different styles, and here they share tips like use simple words and sentence structure, avoid overly complex language, keep the visual content as simple as possible. Using words like Oriental mood, China and Asia can more easily generate a Chinese style and deficit Chinese people. Current large video models are not sensitive to numbers, making it difficult to maintain consistency in counts. For a split scene, a split screen scene, you can use a prompt like four camera angles representing spring, summer, autumn, and winter. At the current stage, it is, it is challenging to generate complex physical movements, such as bouncing of a ball or a trajectory of a high altitude throw. Okay, so many guidelines, and let me show you what I was able to generate. So I first I did um, three different tests. The first one was Kling. 1.0 which is the older model and to be honest it has been generating for more than 30 minutes already i think it might be stuck this was the prompt so the title was the peculiar journey of tom tomato and ben bell pepper and i just basically gave it a few scenes completely made up and used claude to elaborate about the prompt so first class departure open with a luxurious first-class airplane cabin interior. A tomato and a bell pepper are seated in plush seats. They are wearing sunglasses and have tiny suitcases next to them. The cabin is decorated in an unusual color scheme of pink and black. As the plane takes off, Tom and Ben look out of the window excitingly. And then I gave it more scenes, uh, but the, I didn't notice that the, uh, it is limited to five or 10 second generation. So, um, it just generated the first scene and the instruction for the creation was use bright vibrant colors animate tom and ben with exaggerated bouncy movements to emphasize their fruit vegetable nature employ smooth transitions between scenes add humorous details in the background use upbeat adventurous music include sound effects to enhance the action now the first model cling 0.1 did, didn't is still generating I, I i might be able to show you an example by the end of the video or tomorrow i don't know but when i upgraded to cling 1.5 which is the new model it generated the video pretty fast note that i started generating this video the first one was the mod was the older model before i started generating this video so this video is way faster and this is what it was able to generate a tomato and a bell pepper suitcases everything is looks luxurious pretty much following the prompt so open with a luxurious first class airplane cabin interior tomato and bell pepper they are wearing sunglasses as you can see here the cabin is decorated in an unusual color scheme of pink and black as you can see as the plane take off tom and ben look out the window excitingly let's see this again full screen they look pretty happy and obviously you can download this and without the watermark you can edit and regenerate and this is pretty much it let's see what's the status of the new video because i asked it to create a, a new video about two mosquitoes drinking mojitos on a beach in mexico the mojitos are full of ice and the beach is full of watermelons sunset in the background so i tried to create a bit of a more simple prompt this time 10 seconds long and the aspect ratio was uh, 16 on 9 you can also choose the number of generations you can also select the camera movement which is disabled in this version and you can obviously add a negative prompt let's wait for this to generate unless it takes like a ton of time the first model as you can see if using a uh, cling 1.0 you can add camera movement but since i'm using over here 
cling 1.5 i'm unable to add camera movement but that's fine let's wait uh, until the new video is going to generate this um, video took approximately five or ten minutes this is uh, twice as long because it's 10 seconds long so it might take a bit longer I will pause the video in the meantime okay I was actually about to conclude the video without waiting for this video to be generated it took 15 minutes and because the results are pretty amazing I decided to reopen the video file that I wanted to publish and record this and show you guys the result so as you you probably remember that the prompt was two mosquitoes drinking mojitos on a beach in Mexico. The mojitos are full of ice and the beach is full of watermelons, sunset in the background, and this is what it generated. I'm pretty excited. It's pretty, pretty great. Check out two mosquitoes, sunset, watermelons, mojitos full of ice. Very realistic, nice camera movement. It's actually pretty mind-blowing that this was generated from uh, a, a prompt which was five lines long. I guess that's it for today, guys. I just wanted to share with you this amazing text-to-video tool called Kling uh, and the new model Kling 1.5. It's very cheap. I, I pay like three bucks or eight bucks monthly and you get a ton of credits. Highly recommend that you check it out if you're interested in generating um, video ads or reels or shows, whatever. This, um, if you add a layer of voiceover and some background music, you can create magic with this tool. That's it for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to subscribe and leave a comment below with your feedback. Until next time, keep on automating.